Hello everyone, this is Arif. I'm here to help you to understand uh, difficult business concept in a layman terms. So let's jump to our today's topic. It is uh, what is corporate governance? To understand the, the concept behind corporate governance, we have to understand the term corporate governance. So corporate basically means uh, an entity um, and governance means how to run that entity. So basically corporate governance is nothing more than a set of rules and regulation which is there to help or to assist the organization to make right decision and to run their operation more effectively. So the question is why we need a framework for, a, for an organization to follow. The reason being is um, we have seen in the history in the past like many organizations they get bankrupt and when an organization get bankrupt there is a wider uh, set of stakeholders which get impacted by. Those stakeholders are uh, shareholders, um, even the government employees, how they are affected by. Let's say if an organization go bankrupt, the shareholder will lose their money. Similarly, the employees will lo lose their jobs and the government will lose the taxes. Um, the banks will lose their loan amount prepayment and the, the society in general will lose their services. So in order to protect and safeguard all those entities, uh, uh, the the government, the different government, they put forward a set of rules and regulations which are considered to be helping the organization to to um, carry out their operation in a more effective and ethical manner. So this is the concept behind the corporate governance, and uh, there are different names given to the same framework in different countries. For example, if it is legislated or made mandatory, those rules. Uh, it is uh, being made part of the part of the law, uh, and then we have a good example in the U.S. We call it SOX compliance uh, legislation. Similarly, we have a corporate governance code in in the U.K. We have King's report in the South Africa. So the name might differ from country to country, but the concept remains the same. So I hope you have you understand this concept very clearly and I wish you uh, good luck in your life, in your career and hope to see you in the next video with a new topic and uh, till then, take care and goodbye.